Hi everyone, welcome back to TS Talk Sport. In this one, just talking about Lucas Torreira. Now, AC Milan currently, um, apparently rumoured to be interested in Torreira again. I mean, they're looking to put in a bid of around 35 million in the summer, or whenever the transfer window is going to be. Um, obviously, in light of the current worldwide situation, I mean, they all, they all want to bring Torreira to their club. Now, you know, it was earlier on this season where, you know, Torreira apparently wasn't happy um, with how things were playing out in England and, you know, wanted a move. Um, I also believe a lot of that was playing under Una Emery, um, where apparently he wanted to play further forward. And, you know, myself and along with many fans was thinking, why is this guy playing as a number 10? You know, we signed him as a defensive midfielder. That's where we want to see him play. And at the time, you know, I think it was both him and Xhaka that looked like they wanted to leave. And I did a video saying, well, if you want to leave, leave. You know, at the end of the day, no player's bigger than the club. And, you know, I've seen many players go with my time. And, you know, the same goes for Torreira. If he wants to leave, he can do so. Um, I think he's... Him, along with the likes of Xhaka, have been a bit more happy with, with life at Arsenal and uh, Mikel Arteta. Um, but at the same time, you know, uh, deep down, I think um, he was more comfortable playing in Italy. And, you know, if he wants to go back to Italy, um, I'll gladly take the 35 million bid and, and run with it, to be honest with you. Um, nothing against Herrera, you know, when he, whenever we were playing, you know, I I I, I sing that Lucas Torreira song, you know Torreira, whoa, I I sing it, and you know even you know I've got my kids know the song and even my nephew knows the song, so it goes to show you, you know, how invested I am in in the club and and Torreira as a player, but um, you know there's all these talks that we're interested in the likes of Thomas Party from Atletico Madrid, and personally based on this current situation, epidemic, pandemic, whatever, um, I don't think we're going to have that much money to really splash out in the summer. So, you know, for me, I think sending the lights of a Torreira, uh, um, the money on that can be used to, to secure in someone like a, a Thomas Party. But, you know, that's just my thoughts on it. Hopefully, you know, the club are going to splash out in the summer, but it this thing kind of gives them a... A reason to be like, well, we haven't actually got that much money. Um, you know, we've lost all this revenue, sponsorship money, etc., due to what happened with the league and stuff. So, who knows? But for me, like I said, nothing against Herrera, but facing Milan, I'm willing to pay 35 million for him. You know, um, if I was in charge, I'd gladly accept and put that money towards someone like a Thomas Party. But that's just me, that's my opinion on it. Obviously, I don't expect everyone to agree. Um, but at the same time, you can let me know your thoughts about it in the comment section below. And if you haven't already done so, go hit that subscribe button now and I'll catch you next time.